Hi guys, I'm Young. I hope you guys have been enjoying my travel vlog in Tibet. I will come back with more videos from Tibet very soon. But meanwhile, I want to actually talk about how I use Power Director to simply and quickly edit my drone footage. So I've been actually using Power Director for the last almost two years. First, I started with 15 and then I was pretty happy with it, so I decided to upgrade to 16. I'll show you guys how I edit the drone footage, color correcting, cutting, and so on. It's very, very simple using Power Director. Yeah! Okay, let's get straight into the software and I'll show you how. For this video, I've actually incorrectly used the brightness of the video. I need to do something about this footage. In Power Director, the most useful function is this fix and enhance. Then it gives you this menu. I really like using light adjustment. So this one, for example, it will brighten up the light. In the case of extreme backlight, in this particular video, there isn't backlight. I'll just click the button to show you what it does definitely brightens up but I feel it's really unnatural in this particular video that it brightens myself Aww. up in the video that's too much and then in this scale you can actually go down and up to adjust the lighting you can actually compare in split preview so you can definitely see it's a lot lighter so this video is just way too dark so I'm gonna actually increase the brightness Maybe that's a little too bright Maybe also a little bit more exposure as well. You can really see the difference. And that was just quick button moves to brighten up the video and it looks a lot better. The second function that I love using, especially when I'm making a complete YouTube video, is the color match. It came in the Power Director 16. So this is the footage from the train and then another footage from Taka Salt Lake. I wasn't very familiar with the CPL lens so I was using the CPL filter and they completely cut out all the reflection. The blueness from the sky is just completely gone. So the color in these two videos are totally, totally different. I can adjust it using these adjustments and so on but you know I'm not as good as computer which means I need to just click on the other footage maybe go to the place that I want to use and press match color and see the color is match okay this is a little bit too much for me then you can actually choose the level what I love about this software is that it gives you a very simple button to do the function like match color lighting adjustment and then you can actually toggle your way you know through the spectrum and adjust the color as you see fit and when you also use the color enhancement can you see how it's really the color just popped up so if you want a lot of enhancement but it may look a little bit unnatural then you can go all the way to 100 but then you can also adjust it to lower to make it a bit more natural let me actually show you guys the video it really pops out the color it looks so much more vibrant wow especially in here where you show the mountain you see a huge difference in terms of what the color enhancement did here it looks a little bit grayish but then with color enhancement you can really see the blue color popping out another function that i want to show you is the hdr effect if you just go to hdr effect glow strength edge strength and then you can very easily adjust to give a bit more like layer to the video this is awesome if you have taken some great scenery drone footage as you can see in the software it has simple buttons where it can really enhance your video I hope you found this one quite useful in consideration of what kind of software you want to buy to edit your videos. If you already have Power Director, then please share with me some of the features that you really like. And if you have any questions about the software, then please feel free to ask me. I'll try my best to find the answer for you. And please don't forget to give me likes and subscribe to my channel. In the next videos, I'll come back with the Tibet travel vlog. Please do stay tuned and see you!